I remember the trailers for this one. It's not the house that's haunted. It's your son. Are you out of your mind? And if so, can I have some, please? The boys who made Saul are back, and it's insidious. A family have moved into their new home. Dad's at work. Mum's at home with the baby and working on her music. The two boys were at school. Everything's relatively fine. Everything's normal. Until the eldest son goes to sleep and stays asleep. The doctors are baffled, but Grandma has an answer. Apparently the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. What's happening to the boy has happened to the father when he was younger. Malicious forces are lurking, hoping to take control. Enter horror icon Lin Shay and her team to investigate. Supernatural movies and TV of the past used to freak me out. When I was a kid, I saw a movie called The Manitou. A woman has a lump on her shoulder. As it grows, it turns out to be a fetus of a long dead medicine man. <laughs> Because he tried to kill him on the operating table. You! Finally! Oh, what happened? Then, as a teenager, the TV movie Ghost Watch kept me awake for weeks. Oh, Jesus! Kimmy! Ken! Where are you? Can't you do something? <gasps> Susie. Oh, Stop it! Stop it, Susie! Suzanne, you're coming with me. Suzanne! You're coming with Suzanne! These are many that were handmade. No CGI whatsoever. Today it's mandatory as it is expensive. But the likes of James Wan, who used smaller budgets, but delivered greater effect. His last movie, Malignant, cost Forty million dollars. Small compared to Aquaman. The budget for Insidious, 1.5 million dollars. And has been called by others a movie you can either not watch alone or can only watch once. I can still hear that voice. I had a lot of fun with this one, and as we know, there have been three sequels so far. James Wan has submitted himself as one of the groundbreaking horror directors, with three franchises under his belt. Joining the ranks next to names like Carpenter, Craven, Hooper, Argento, Hitchcock. He is also one of today's most bankable directors.